Hi there guys. Okay, since we are still in villain month, I will introduce you to one of Batman's most underrated and underused villains. Judson Pierce, aka Scale. Now Pierce's backstory is tightly involved with the history of the Waynes and the Elliots. And for those that don't know, uh, Thomas Elliot is the real name of Harsh, which is one of Batman's most uh, uh, most demented adversaries. Judson Pierce started out as a mob boss that tried to kill Thomas' father, which made Thomas' dad act very angry and sometimes even abusive against, well, Thomas Elliot. Pierce also tried to kill Martha Wayne, which is Bruce Wayne's mom, uh, when he couldn't buy up the streets where uh, she and Leslie Tompkins. Uh, worked, but uh, fortunately he was sentenced to jail before he could kill her. And the reason he went to jail is because uh, Elliot and uh, Pierce, uh, Pierce's own boss Salaguso, sold him out. Thirty-seven years later, he was released from prison and swore revenge on the Wayne legacy. But since uh, Martha Wayne was dead, he decided instead of, you know, taking down Bruce Wayne. He teamed up with Hush and Dr. Death. Uh, but of course, Hush betrayed them and locked in Pierce and Dr. Death in a house he was planning to burn down. Death and Pierce managed to escape by throwing acid at a door, but in the process Pierce's fat and a lot of his muscles burned off. So now he looks like a skeleton covered in burned skin. That was when he was captured by Batman and he was locked in in Blackgate Penitentiary. In prison he created his own gang and renamed himself Skell. Now Skell is not only a short for skeleton but is also a synonym for gangster or lowlife. One thing I love about Skell is that while most people has fat and muscles uh, as shock absorbers when whenever where we punch someone uh, kind of minimizing the damage but when this guy punch you you will feel only hard solid bone hitting your face now if you don't have much muscle tissue you will probably uh, not be able to even lift your arm but you know it's it's comics and Batman runs on comic book logic. Uh, I also like him because he has a very interesting uh, character arc. He went from a pity uh, crook that hit rock bottom to a man ready to risk everything including his own life in order not to be a laughing stock. Pierce has really just been in the Batman comic series Streets of Gotham, but I really wish DC would use him in uh, in some more comics, like in the new uh, Batman run. In conclusion, Judge John Pierce might not be as famous as Two Face or Bane, but he is a great entry in the Batman Rogues Gallery, and I highly recommend you read Batman Streets of Gotham.